So this problem reads, the total number of Hispanic or white HIV cases that were attributed to heterosexual activity in the U.S. is around 12,274. If the total number of sexually active heterosexual Hispanic or white males in the U.S. is currently 75,328,725, what is the probability that one randomly selected heterosexual Hispanic or white male has HIV? So I've underlined some important phrases in the problem. Probability, of course, indicates it's a probability question. And then we have this statement that we're just selecting one randomly selected heterosexual Hispanic or white male. The fact that we're only taking one means this problem has to involve either basic probability, the addition rule of probability, or conditional rule of probability. Now, conditional rule has the phrase given that with it, so we don't have anything like that in this problem, so it's not conditional rule. It could be addition. Some people would think it's addition because of the word or here. But that's actually not the use of the word or that implies addition rule. In order for it to be addition rule, we'd have to be looking for the probability that someone randomly selected is either Hispanic or white. But that's not what we're doing here. We're selecting one person from the group of Hispanic or white males, and we're asking what's the probability that that person has HIV. That means all we have to do to do this problem is a basic probability fraction. That's all that's needed. So all we have to do to do this problem is to do a basic probability fraction. And that basic probability fraction is going to essentially be the probability that a Hispanic or white male has HIV. And of course, that's going to be broken up as a fraction that has a numerator of number of and the denominator of total. So you know the top will do number of, and this will be number of Hispanic or white males with HIV. So number of Hispanic or white males with HIV divided by the total number of Hispanic or white males. And so these numbers are found in the problem. It tells us that there are 12,274 cases of HIV in this group. So 12,274 cases in that group. And the total number of Hispanic or white males in the country is 75,328,725. So 75,328,725. So this problem is that simple. It's just a matter of coming up with the probability that one of the, some member of this group has HIV, and it's just a simple basic fraction of probability. And if we divide these two values, let's see what we get. So we'll have 12,274 divided by 75,328,725. When we do that, we get this answer. Now this is in scientific notation, so we have to move the decimal place over four places to the left because the negative indicates to the left. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. That'll put three zeros before the one, six, two, nine. So we'll have something like point zero, 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 and then one, six, two, nine. And that's essentially our answer.